So in problem number six, we're asked to rewrite the three to the four fifths power in radical form. Well, taking a look here, I know that radical form means we're going to need a radical. The bottom number right here in the fraction is going to give me the index of the radical. And then inside the radical is going to go three to the fourth. Now, if I wanted to, I could go ahead on my calculator and say three to the fourth power is 81. So the other way that we could have written this is as radical 5, or the fifth root of 81. Make my 8 look more like an 8. And either one of these would be acceptable.